our second special guest slot tonight, and it's American legend that is T.J. Christian. Welcome, T.J. Hi, Willie, man. It's great to be on the show with you tonight. How's everything going? All is doing great. It's great to have you on and finally to catch up and have a chat with you. Oh, absolutely. I'm sorry I missed you when we over when we were there in two lab, but uh, we'll catch you next time for sure. Yeah, definitely. You were in Cork with the Phil Mack show, and it was an outstanding success by all accounts. Oh, we we all had just a wonderful time. We've never been treated better. I mean, the folks made us feel like family, and we definitely want to come back and do it again because uh, up to date, uh, I've been probably around the world and uh, every place over here, but. But uh, those shows we did in Ireland is my favorite places I've been. Yeah, I think um, everyone that comes over from uh, from Ireland has the same. Um, they seem to be a little awestruck by something. I suppose they don't, the the country is so popular over here that we're listening to your music here all the time, and we love it when you do come over. You know. Oh, that's fantastic! You know, and, <clears throat> and I I can never tell the DJs how much I appreciate them for supporting their music and the fans for tuning into guys like you and listening to the music and supporting it. I mean, without you and the fans, either there couldn't be me or any other artist. Ah, uh, yeah, we we love to to share the music and we love to promote when we can. It's helping each other along the way, I suppose, don't we? A- abs- absolutely, <clears throat> and you know. I'm wide open. Anything I can do to help you, Willie, I'm always available. And if I can do it, I'll sure do it. Much appreciated. Thank you very much. Um, the music, you must have um, seen a lot of changes over the years. Oh, a- absolutely. It's uh, a lot of changes. And, you know, from my opinion in Nashville, it's not changed for the better. Our music kind of went uh, out in the left field somewhere. and But... Uh, I'll always uh, keep it country as I possibly can, because that's my roots and that's what I do. And, and uh, I'm going to stay with the music that says something and reaches people. Yeah, I I think there's a, there's enough there to keep your stellar country to keep it going to generations because it's yeah it's gone a bit poppy out there and a little bit rocky, but it's the tradition is getting it's holding its own. I think it comes and goes in waves. It does. I, I think it'll come back around eventually. You know, the, uh, when uh, when we get enough people that want to hear the traditional country music, that the kind of music that I do, I think uh, I think it'll come back around. And uh, and as we travel around the United States, uh, we see so many fans that are really hungry to have my kind of music back on the radio again. But we'll wait and see if that happens. Ah, uh, yeah, I. I think you're right. It will happen. It will. Yeah, I spoke recently with um, Leona Williams and her son Ron. They were over on tour as well. And they'd be kind of the same style of country as yourself. They'd be old school. Absolutely. Leona's a lovely person and Ron's a wonderful artist. And and I might add, uh, your your artist uh, over there that was on the shows with, they're, they're awesome. You know, there's some great talent over there and we certainly enjoyed being on the show with them. Yeah, we, we we produce a nice crop of writers as well. I suppose you know you're familiar with Shuni Cramsey. Oh, absolutely. Love Shuni. Cut one of his songs on a new album, and he, he got to be on stage and sing it with me That all three shows, and that was a blessing. That was just an absolute a plus to it for the show. Yeah, it's nice when you get that opportunity to get together. Oh, Sh- Shuni's a wonderful artist and a fine writer, and... And it was just so much pleasure to have him up on stage with us and, and sharing some songs and music together. He did a great job. Definitely. And another friend there of the show is um, Trevor Lockery was on each bill with you. Oh, yeah. Trevor was on. We got to meet Trevor and take some pictures with him. And <clears throat> we got to meet everybody that was on the show. And, and I'll tell you, they were all just great. Ah, uh, mighty. That brings us to the next guest. She was on, she was on with me earlier. Um, and that's Elizabeth McFarland, your duet partner. Oh yes, uh, you know I've been uh, I've been looking around quite some time for a female artist that that I felt would be good to do the Vanish and Breed duet with me. And I was on Facebook one day, and she put up a post, and I went to SoundCloud and listened to a couple of songs, and and uh, her voice struck me right off. You know, she had that nice, warm tone to her voice, and and. Uh, 
uh, convincibility, I call it. You know, I, I thought that she would really help me sell the song uh, like I wanted to hear it. And so I, I sent her over uh, the uh, track with my vocals, and she put her vocals on and sent it back, and we mixed it and released it. And it's just doing great. She did a wonderful job. Yeah, I played it earlier in the show, and I spoke to her about it, and it's yeah, it's a it's a fantastic. I think you really do complement each other. Yeah, she she was uh, the kind of voice that I was kind of looking for and hoping I would find, and uh, and uh, I was fortunate that I did find her. And like I say, she did a wonderful job, and folks seem to be liking our version of the record really good. So again, that's good country music, and it's a song that I wanted to uh, write and kind of remind people that uh, so many of the great vanishing breed is is vanishing every day that's it yeah she gave us a background on it and it is yeah it tells a lovely story of that but yeah that, that's kind of what we were aiming at we wanted to keep folks in mind that you know we're losing great artists and and people in all kinds of uh, all kinds of professions you know uh they're just they're just passing away uh, right and left and and I kind of wanted a song out there that would mind people and, and you know, keep them mindful that, uh, that we won't be around forever and, you know, support them while they're here. That is it, yeah. The generations don't belong catching up behind us and moving along. Absolutely. But the, um, yeah, you've been to Ireland. Do you tour extensively in America as well? Yes, all, yeah, we, we've been uh, done probably... We, but it shows have been about 110, 20 days a year, and if you add in the travel time, it's over 200 days a year we're out. Yeah, that, that's a busy schedule. That's Yeah, yeah, we've been very busy the last couple of years for sure. But it'll slow down a little bit now come wintertime. You know, we won't be as busy. I know what you mean. It's the season for us at the moment, and you're enjoying it. So. Oh, ab absolutely. The weather's been beautiful, and it's starting to look like fall over here now. And, because I love all four seasons, and it doesn't take much to make me happy as long as it don't get too cold. Oh, very good. Are you a fan of the fishing? Yes, I used to fish a lot, but I haven't had much time in the last few years, but but uh, hopefully I'll get a chance to do that again. Yeah, you know, the reason I ask you is um, Ron Williams was a big fan of fishing, and we've kind of arranged the next time he's over to have a day on the river. To be nice. Oh, that would be fantastic. I, I've... <clears throat> The last time I got to go fishing was when I was with, with Jerry Reed. We was up in Canada doing a show, and, and we all went out and had a day on the lake up there, and it was wonderful. Ah, uh, great stuff. Yeah, you never know. We might all meet up. Wouldn't that be fun? Hell, <laughs> I'm telling you, it was, it was a lot of fun. It was with a great artist and a good friend, and we just had a marvelous time out there. Great stuff. Now, do you, um, people saying hello there on Facebook to you? Yeah. Facebook is great for the communications, isn't it? Oh, it's absolutely. That's one thing about the Internet has really opened up the world to independent artists like myself. You know, we could, it just made the world smaller, and, and we can instantly communicate with so many of our fans and DJs. It's just wonderful. Yeah, it is. It's it's a nice time that we live in. Everything it, is. It, it, it is. It, you know, it took me a while to catch up with some of the technology, but I'm so glad I hung with it and did because <clears throat> because I can sit here at this computer and, and feel like I'm in the living room with some of my friends over there. That's right, yeah, it's it's great. But the, um, just back to the music again, TJ, uh, are you still um, writing and recording? Oh, ab ab absolutely. Uh, our new album's doing really well, and I'm, I'm really proud of our new album. It's one of the best I've put out, I think. It's some of the feedback I'm getting anyway but we'll be uh, we'll be working on a new one uh, shortly and and hopefully sometime uh, next year we'll have it ready to go uh, we look forward to that we really do um no um just to let people know at home um your music is it Facebook or is there a website they can get your music at uh I've, I sell all my music on CD Baby and all the uh, digital download sites. So, so if they log on to CD Baby uh, dot com slash CD slash TJ Christian, they'll just find everything I've got. Ah, oh, great, great. Yeah, we'll put links on our page there as well. We can set you up with that. And um, basically, we want to say thank you so much for coming on, and we want to wish you all the best in the future. Oh, thank you, Willie, for having us, and and, and thank all those folks listening tonight. And, and you're the reason we do this. There's no doubt about it. 
we, we love we love to do some country music and when people love what we do we feel like we've accomplished what we wanted to do very good just before you go there just there's um kel joan and thomas want to say hi they're all the gang there on facebook and paul as well oh i certainly will and thanks again willie for sir playing our music and supporting us and like i say anytime you need me son you just holler and uh, whatever i can do to help you i'll be more than happy no problem i might be on to you during the week for a jingle or two you never know oh, right. <laughs> I'll, I'll be glad to do it for you thank you very much i'm going to play this out now and i just want to say bye for now we will we will talk again thanks tj Thank you, Willie, and, and 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 have a great night. And all our friends out there listening, we we wish you all the best, and hope we can see you again soon. Certainly will. Bye.